Hi everyone and welcome along. Today we're looking at water hammers. Yeah, the noise you get in your pipes, you know, when you turn the water off and you get that massive bang. What the hell is that? Sometimes you can get it at night. There's several things you can do to sort this one out and I'll tell you what they are. It's pretty simple. One of the first things that I always try is to slow the flow down. Now, it won't stop pressure, that will still go, but find your main stopcock and just turn it right off and then turn it back on slowly. Crazy, I'm going to turn the, the tap on now. I'm happy enough with that. Now, if you've identified where the bang comes from, and we're saying it's a toilet system upstairs, it might be worth just locating the valve and you've got one on it. If not, it's worth putting one of these on. They cost nothing. They're really, really cheap. And just adjust that down. So it, again, it fills in a lot more slowly than it did before. This might also stop the bang for you. Now, the reason I'm pointing to this stopcock in the cupboard is because this pipe leads up into the loft to the roof tank ball valve. If you find your noise happens at night when water is drawn off and you get a bang in, it could well be the roof tank ball valve needs changing. But you can again, if you have a valve in it like I have on this one, try slowing that down again and slowing the speed down. Not too much for the roof tank because you do need quite a heavy flow in here. So I advise if it does come from the roof tank, probably best to change the ball cock in there. Now I'm pointing at this clip that's come away from this pipe because this is another thing what causes a water hammer. Pipes are not clipped securely and you get a bang. I mean look, you can see where that's touching that wood up there. That is a potential water hammer. So clip the pipe if you find that it's loose anywhere, tighten it, fix it down, help stop that noise from happening. Now I'm showing you these basin taps because a, a friend I just did a job for the other day found that the water hammer she had was so severe that it was actually making the taps run every time it went bang so the tap run uh, this is obviously you know the pressure is so badly the bang it is causing the cartridge in there to move it's probably worn that's why it's doing it but again it, every time it happened if you're finding you've got a tap suddenly starts dripping or running after the bang not only is the cartridge worn in the tap but that effect of the bang is so severe that it is causing problems elsewhere with your system. So it's very important to get this little problem sorted out. First of all, I say, do try to locate the exact place where it is banging. And that will be the probably where you might need to fit something like this. I'm going to show you now if all else fails. Now then, second on the list of last resort items is one of these, which is a shock arrester. Okay, to stop thumping pipes. Basically, it's a pressure vessel, takes the shock out of things. It's good to get this as close to where you think the noise is coming from. But disadvantage, obviously, is that it's quite big, it's bulky, it's got to be hidden away somewhere because uh, it looks quite ugly. You can't really have that on show, can you? So, that is a good idea if you can get close to where the noise is happening, especially, say, like roof tanks in cupboards and things. If you can get it away out of sight, uh, it, it does seem to work okay. But that's not the be end of all. The, the very best thing to do is to do one of these I'm going to show you next but by the way I will give you the link for this if you'd like one of these I'll put it in the description one last thing obviously is to attack the problem at source and that is to reduce the pressure completely and this will reduce the pressure itself which does cause the bang that's if you fancy putting one of these on the main inlet to your house or you fill up to it and can fit it in this obviously will also do the job and obviously slow the pressure everywhere to a, a rate where you get that noise stopped this is sometimes more preferable by lots of people I'll give you a link for this one as well <laughs> Okay, so that's it. Just a little one I thought I'd tell you about. Uh, say, the experience I had the other week at um, a house for a, a lady who had problems with her taps and she couldn't quite work out why. Whenever this bang went off, her base and taps started to dribble. And <laughs> so I had two jobs in one, really. Repair the tap and also sort out the water hammer, which I did do actually just by turning the main stock cock down a little bit. It actually sorted that one out without having to put a shock arrestor in. So that was worth doing, wasn't it? Okay, that's about it though. Just a little one from me, a little information video, really. Thanks again for watching, everybody. Derrick and 33 for my stuff. You know where to go. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye.